I was riding my dirt bike when I blew a tire and admittedly I drove it back all the way home and completely destroyed it. So I bought a brand new one. However, I'm concerned because it looks a lot bigger than the original tire, even though it's the same size. But since it came with a new tube, I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit and put it on. The first step was loosening the axle with the 18 millimeter socket and a 14 millimeter wrench and releasing the tension from the tensioner. And since everything loosened up, using a screwdriver and a hammer, I pushed in the axle and massaged it out from the other side. Next was the brake assembly, but that was the easy part because it just slid off. But before the tire comes off, these two nuts need to come off first. And here's something everybody does differently. Using miscellaneous tools, I popped the bead on one side of the wheel. So when the tire is flipped over, I could just pull it off the rim. But before putting the new tire on, the rim had to be clean because it looked overly crusty. So with a sharp blade, I removed all decals and brushed it off with soapy water. And it came out almost as bright as your future. But this part is the part that I dread the most because putting on a new tire is harder than a bead from Dr. Dre. And although lubricating the tire helps a lot, it's still best to have someone help you because doing it by yourself is nearly impossible. But it went on cleanly, so I started putting everything back together in the same order that it came off and i don't have an air compressor here so i aired it up at a gas station but after that i spent the rest of the day riding around and it was a load of fun